Hey Tilted Barners, we're up at it early this morning. We've had a little bit of a warm up since the last video, so we're trying to beat the weather and uh, go get some wood cut before things thaw out today and uh, we start getting things a little muddied up. So since the last video you saw that everything was frozen, we had a ton of snow. Well in the last few days we have, uh, we've had quite a thaw and so all the, all the snow that we had, it's, a lot of it's melted. Um, so we're starting to see some spots in the fields where uh, the snow is starting to come away. Um, you know, you can see out in the pasture behind me, uh, you know, there's just, uh, you're just starting to see more brown and, and stuff than what we had before where obviously you couldn't see anything. So my goal today is to go get a load of firewood while the ground's still hard with the frost so that we're not tearing the field up that we got to go through uh, or leaving ruts in the, in the field or the woods for that matter. So that's the plan for today. Thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to hit that thumbs up and subscribe. Well, as long as I'm loading everything up, I thought I might as well take a minute to uh, show you what I have in my toolbox. So I have a toolbox that I take with me that is only for cutting wood. And it's just got pretty much most everything that I need. I'm sure other people out there have a lot more or maybe even a little less, but this is what I use. So in here, I've got an extra spark plug, extra files, got your chainsaw wrench. Um, in here, I've got my um, sharpening kit. So this has got my flat file, um, a gauge here, and then this kit is for my big saw, and so this has got the 3 ace file in it. So that's, uh, that's what's in the little pack there. Um, here's the file for my small saw. And if you see on the cover, um, I've got labeled uh, sharp top, dull bottom, and those are for my chains, just so I know <laughs> for my own purposes. Otherwise, I'll forget and I'll get them mixed up. I always keep the sharp chains, the good chains on the top, and in the bottom, I keep all the dull ones. So you can see down here, these are the ones that need to be resharpened. Um, I've got an assortment of wedges. You can see some of these are pretty beat up. Um, a mallet for driving in the wedges. Um, and I like using the wedges. They work great um, for if, if you end up getting your bar pinched or something like that, or if you're trying to follow a tree a certain direction, it, it really helps doing that too. So, but this is pretty much in a nutshell, um, pretty much what, uh, whoops, I should probably put these back in the right spot. Um, you know, this pretty much goes, oh, here's, uh, you can see some extra, I got some extra nuts here for the bar and stuff too. Um, so, but yeah, that's, that's just what I use. 
Uh, I also, as far as sharpening chains, uh, I go every other tank and I just run a hand file across them. And uh, unless I hit something, I get probably a year's worth of cutting out of one chain, or I shouldn't say a year, a season's worth of cutting out of one chain. Um, I didn't used to do that. And I found that with just running these files across them is just increased the life of those chains dramatically. Um, it used to be, I would take a chain in, um, probably three, four times a year to get sharpened. And now if I take a chain in once a year, that's quite a bit. Um, and I, I cut a lot of wood every weekend. I'm cutting two tanks of gas. So really makes a difference. All right, we're all fueled up and ready to go.
here too long and it's already starting to get pretty warm. I know the high for tomorrow's, or all weekend really, is uh, between 46 and 48 degrees. So this snow isn't going to last long. In fact, the pile that I got here, it's getting warm enough. I think I'm just going to uh, get, uh, get this stuff all loaded up and then I'm going to get back to the farm before things get too greasy back here. All right, well, we got it done. And I tell you what, it's true what they say, wood heats twice, because I'm really warm. I'm out of shape, but I'm really warm. So once again, thanks everybody for watching, and I'm just gonna remind you, hit that subscribe button, it really helps. Take care, enjoy the rest of the day.